You mind to talk a minute? Was this what you was planning? Be honest, you want it? Come on, get up, I want it. Hands full of innocence, touching you when I sin. Admit it, you've been with it. No witnesses committed. At first, it felt so wrong. They wanted us no more. The love we have held on. There's nothing breaking us up. Steady wanted what we were. Hold me, you're just enough. Let me take your hand and run. Hey, RT family, shout out to your Ruby, and I'm back with another video, y'all. My wife is currently still putting her clothes on, but as y'all can tell by the title, y'all, we are gonna go on like a little, you know, little date. Would you say it's like a date, babe? Yeah. Yeah. Going on a little date, y'all. We're going to watch the WNBA. We're gonna support, you know, the Las Vegas Aces because we do live in Las Vegas, and um, you know, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Growing up as a little girl, you know, I've always loved basketball, so like. I've always dreamt big, you know, about saying like, I'm gonna be in the WNBA one day, blah, blah, blah. Obviously that's not the case. I'm in a whole other situation right now, but y'all, I'm really big when it comes to supporting women and supporting WNBA. So we have gone to a NBA game. This is our first WNBA game, so I'm so excited, y'all. And um, you know what, we have to get going. We're not gonna be able to bring the camera maybe after the game because of like security purposes. So we're we'll get going. We're with our phone. Trying to get to the. Yeah, we're so lost. Bro. We're so lost, and we're like, so and late. We're so late. But that's so, okay because we're tomorrow's, and we always run on tomorrow time. So. It's seven thirteen, y'all, and it starts at seven. We are so lost. Like we we're just so true. Like the traffic was bad, but <laughs> I think we're almost there. We're almost there. Yeah. You know the thing about me and my wife, we've always been in love with the sport. Like basketball is like our top sport. And yo, know, it was good to see like Tarazi was there. Um Diggin Smith. Yo, yeah, we got there. this close to yeah. Um Diggin Smith was there. Um Brittany Griner was there. We saw Cambridge, like there was a lot of people there. It was, it was yeah. fun, it was a good time. 
We're gonna answer the clips, but you guys saw that Shaq was there. That was really dope. He was like across from us, so. Y'all saw that we montaged it because there was like music playing. We don't want to get copyrighted, but right. that was a good time. This is a, I love this day, baby. Yes. We need to do this more, this yeah. day more often, you know? Like, that was really fun, y'all. This yeah. is definitely not gonna be our last, so. But yeah, we're just waiting on Kevin to pick us up and then we're gonna grab some good dessert to eat on. I don't know, y'all. Yeah, we'll, we'll, see. Uh, we'll see where this vlog takes us, but yeah. it's like past 9 p.m. So we'll see what's open and stuff when we get home. But I'm low-key kind of hungry, I'm not gonna lie. But I was trying to get Plum to like... We're touch, trying to take a picture of them. Touch or, my hand yeah. or something, but you know, COVID protocols, you know, they can't really like yeah. get too close to most uh, you know, people like that. But. Yeah, like this little kid wanted to take a picture of Plum, but you know, the security was yeah. telling her no, no. And then I was like, aw. So I knew our chances were dead too. I'm but. not gonna lie, y'all. Seeing Plum... And seeing Diggin Smith like shake and bake, y'all, yeah, like that reminded me of myself because they're short, but you know, don't, 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 don't underestimate, don't underestimate yeah, short they girls because we can, we can really get it. <laughs> yeah, but that was fun though. Also, guys, I wasn't sure if we could bring the camera into the stadium, so we went safe with it and just vlogged with our phone. So that's why you get our phone quality right now. Don't mind that, but um, yeah, our seats were so dope, babe. Yo, Kevin our is calling right now, so we gotta oh, go. Okay. Sorry, babe, I didn't mean to catch you. No, off. let's go. Yeah, our ride is here. Guys, we are so lost in this parking garage. Oh, no, 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 it's right oh. here. Yeah, man, y'all. Oh, my gosh, okay, we found, we found it. Oh, my gosh. I feel like we, we're so stranded or something. These cars are looking at us like we're crazy. We have the hardest time in this garage. It's just... Oh, my gosh. <laughs> we made out the garage and look at this beautiful stadium across the street. We have yet to go in there. We need to go in there one day, but, you know, we got to support the Raiders, too. But currently waiting for Kevin to pick us up. y'all so we made it back to the crib as y'all could see and yo we almost didn't make it like we saw the time and it was like what was it babe? it closes at 10 and it was it was like 9 56 and kevin was just he was gone okay but we're home we're hungry but i'm not like craving for like a meal meal so i think i'm gonna first and foremost i'm probably gonna eat me a banana because the banana is just staring at me and then i'm probably gonna like boil some corn on the cob babe you gonna make corn yeah, I'm feeling like eating corn. So make me one. Okay. Whew. But y'all, we seen a lot of stars tonight, okay? Like like we mentioned earlier. Look at the camera quality, y'all. Different from the phone, right? The phone's not too bad, but I prefer the camera. But it's a good thing we didn't take it because we really couldn't bring camera in there. But babe, what you doing right now? Shoot, I'm cooking. Trina's having breakfast for dinner. I'm she cooking got some eggs, y'all. I did not eat dinner. I haven't eaten since 10 a.m. So I'm starving right now. And I wasn't trying to like get anything outside because I'm not trying to like eat fast food right now. So a girl is gonna make some eggs and some corn. Kevin was, he had Mickey D's y'all. And that, babe, tell me those fries was not smelling Oh my good. gosh, y'all. We found, he, he got Mickey D's before we got home and I was like, damn, it's smelling your food kind of smelling good. I'm gonna grab me a banana because I'm starving. Starving. And y'all, I need to hydrate because throughout the whole game, I didn't want to pull my mask off because there was like a lot of people around us and I don't know how I feel about that. So I was literally like thirsty. And mind you, as y'all could tell, well, y'all won't be able to tell because we're gonna do like a montage. But me and my wife were screaming our lungs out. Babe, like we were really like, you yeah. know, cheering for the aces, you know, but my throat, my throat is kind of like raspy right now because I was, I'm like, Y'all, I've been to NBA games, me and my wife have, you know, and I, I've seen those, the men, like, they're freaking tall, but, you know, they're men, but, y'all, a lot of these women, oh, my gosh, like, their height was, like, really up there. All right, guys, I got my eggs right here. Mm. Mm. We're actually supposed to get some snacks from there, but I, I low-key wanted, like, nachos or something, but the concession stand next to us only had, like, pretzels and, like, burgers and stuff like that. You know, I'm not sure, I wasn't trying to eat a big meal, I just wanted a snack. So I just wanted like nachos or popcorn, but the popcorn was like in the entrance where we like just came through and you know, we and I were like rushing to our seat because we're like, oh my gosh, this game's starting, we're late. So we didn't stop at a popcorn stand over there because I also thought that there'll be one where we sat, but it was they just only pretzels, have pretzels y'all. and burgers and hot dogs and stuff like that. And I was like, damn, I wanted some nachos or like popcorn or something. So And we were really screaming, so what makes you think we want to eat pretzels and it's gonna kinda like dry up our throat and stuff? So mm. corn's almost there, y'all. Here's our dinner, guys. <laughs> it's literally like 10 30 right now. I know. And I know what you are saying. You better slap some butter on them. But 
y'all no need we can't have butter so we're just gonna have plain which is still good y'all because it's really like sweet naturally sweet naturally sweet. you honestly don't need butter in these corns y'all like the fresh ones mm -hmm. oh my gosh they're so good guys i'm not gonna lie i, I think i was so like hungry and dehydrated and my my mm -hmm. hair is like tight so i was like i was in the car like feeling woozy i was like oh lord <clears throat> hopefully i don't throw up or something but we made it home and your girl got some banana in her i got you know some scrambled eggs in me and now i'm about to get some corn i know some light all right guys so that's gonna be it for this video um as you guys can already see tell by the title this was definitely like a memorable experience yeah. it was definitely fun guys I, I was telling riri tonight like how how much of a good time we had and i'm like babe why is this our first time going to a WNBA game you know like riri and i as you guys know we're all for like women empowerment most especially yes. so we love supporting our women we should definitely be doing this like this should be a regular for us and we agree that we're definitely going to start going to more games well you know with COVID, um yeah that's we're true. really strict with where we're mm -hmm. going and our whereabouts because yes. um you know some people don't follow the mask and mm -hmm. this and what you know so we're just trying to protect ourselves yeah. and our health our lives are in god's hands regardless but we just wanted to to be cautious and be mm -hmm. safe so right but and terrazzi yeah. terrazzi went off i think she scored like 37 points mm -hmm. y'all wow if you guys nice. are following WNBA, terrazzi is like all-time leading scorer right now she's like top okay she's like so and she's been in the league for like mm -hmm a long time but uh, y'all we're gonna go ahead and close out because um we're gonna start getting ready for bed we're gonna shower again mm -hmm. because yes. we're around so much people right. so we definitely you know. gotta wash whatever was at the arena off yeah <laughs> so we're gonna hit the showers we hope you guys enjoyed this vlog it was definitely something different like i said it's both of our first times to go to the WNBA um, game. We basically brought you guys to the game with us, so mm -hmm. we hope you guys enjoyed it. And I hope and pray that one of these days, WNBA sponsors us. So oh my girls. gosh, yeah. If there's any YouTuber out there that Please. should be sponsored by WNBA, it should be your girls, okay? Because we love the sport and we support women yes. and WNBA. It would be everything to be sponsored by the WNBA mm -hmm. and like just having the opportunity to meet those girls and you know, just like, get free tickets to like go watch right. them. Oh my gosh, we'll be like at every game, whether it be here or like in different states. Mm -hmm. That would be so cool, but WNBA hit us up if you see this. If you guys haven't already, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell, and follow us on all social medias. Links will be on the screen and down below in the description. Yeah. So we'll see you guys in the next video. Stay tuned. Peace, Peace and God, God bless. bless. You mind to talk a minute? Was this what you was planning? Be honest, you want it. Come on, get up, I want it. Hands full of innocence.